Let's get right to it. It is a Friday. We're wrapping up the uh, hottest week in history when it comes to our area and much of the state. We look at our current condition. We're sitting at 67 degrees. We're in the 60s. So yes, finally, we can get a little bit of a break inside our homes. Our excessive heat warning is now to the south. We're under a heat advisory, so better conditions. We're going to see that through Saturday at 7 o'clock. So the four things you need to know. Um, still, the heat is out there. We're going to be in the low to mid 90s around the region. Um, the heat advisory until Saturday. We do have smoke and haze expected for today and tomorrow. It's going to be a hot and sunny 4th of July, no doubt about it. And then we're going to be cooling a little bit next week, especially in the overnight hours. We look at what we have for smoke and winds. Uh, we're going to have that potential for haze coming down. The south wind is going to keep it uh, out of our area for a while. And then things look uh, better. Uh, the heat into the Tri-Cities and, of course, smoke to the north. 93 degrees are high today. We're going to see that in Deer Park, 92 and a quarter lane. A uh, few triple digits uh, close, though. Wenatchee, uh, Yakima, Tri-Cities, 99 degrees. But still cooler than what we had <clears throat> for tomorrow. We're going to be into the mid-90s. So, again, that heat advisory is valid and in effect until tomorrow evening. Then things do break. So we look at our four-day forecast. And it's looking like, again, 93, a little hazy today, 96 and hazy tomorrow. Fourth of July, Sunday, 94, and then Monday, 92. But the overnight lows are going to be into the low 60s. And that is going to give us the break we need to cool homes and apartments. I'm Mark Peterson. Thank you for watching this First Alert weather app, free and available to you. Just download it. You'll see hourly temperatures, when it's best to be out and about. And you still need to make sure that things are right for you, your kids, and your pets especially with the heat continuing to be well above average. Have a great day. Have a safe 4th of July.